Lucas Hull to Milan, who gets a bit of room to work with here. This is going to be it. This is going to be a 29th first-class century for David Milan, as easy as you like. Consummate from the man, the left-hander, who raises his bat to all who applaud here at Headingley, and he just clipped it away through point. From Yorkshire putting some runs on the board, and they're continuing to pile them on here, and Milan has just pulled six through mid-wicket, so the change of bowling... It certainly was a false shot. Ahmed is in again. Toomey is driving in the air. Is it going to be caught? He's caught at long off. Running in. Good work. That's uh, Hope has gone. He's um, opened the face and he's chipped one backward of points and he has been caught. Running into the protected area. He's back foot. He's got a wicket though with the very next ball. And uh, on this occasion, George Hill walking out of his crease to try and play the shot has been beaten this pair have put on 46 in that 28 minutes uh, finding in here and a big appeal for lbw milnes is beaten would have liked to it for a little bit longer fifth wicket of the morning for leicestershire right to thompson who's got underneath one and smashed it wow. for six for his fourth wicket of the innings is in bowl short pulled up into the air and over the boundary and deep into the western terrace extra jumper i think as uh, jordan thompson's got underneath this one he's hit it high in the air beyond chris wright and that is another very good catch indeed in bowl slightly short best short armed pull over the backward square boundary for six so what jordan thompson could do was not a subject for discussion, right? Is in short arm pull, and again it's another six. So adding insult to injury is Don Best to Chris Wright. Wright is in bowl, oh, stepping across and lifting it down to fine leg. Brilliant piece of work for six. What an astonishing shot that was by Best. Leicester aware of that. They've brought the field in as in goes Ahmed. Bowls drops short, but it goes through Bess as he tries to pull it away and bowls him. Off stump is out of the ground, so Don Bess is bowled by... Already... Milnes is in, pulled up into the air, should be caught at mid-off by Revis, moving to his right and is. Went for the pull, didn't time it, top edge. We've seen a few of those in this game. In comes Code, and that's hauled away through mid-wicket by Rishi Patel, and it's gone all the way. Coming in past umpire Pollard from the coast to lane end, edged and gone. Adam Lythe takes the catch. Lewis Hill, the Leicestershire captain, is gone. Caught by the Yorkshire counterpart, Adam Lythe. Thompson is in. It's a catch. He's coming, peeling for a court. Come bowling. He's got there inside of the bat and pad. The ball looped up. Thompson didn't quite have to change direction, but obviously he's stepping away from the pitch to his left, which is really in goes Thompson down the leg side and this one is flicked on its on its way by Ackerman for four Revis is in bowls full to Hanscom who drives and quite a sound as though it's uh, got it out of the middle but he's going to pick four nonetheless comes in past umpire Paul Pollard and again straight just a little bit leg side as straight as it turns out because Ackerman has flicked that away and brings himself up a well deserved half century you know tracking forward Revis is in outside of some driven beautifully by Ackerman for four. It was too full and it was too wide. Melnes is in and that's dropped into the leg side by Peter Hanscom, who draws some deserved applause from the crowd that remain here at Headingley. That's Division 1. Here's Melnes rolling in Division 2 and taking a wicket and that of Colin Ackerman. So here's Milnes. How's he going to deal with that? He's going to bowl one that Wee and Mulder has nicked.